the lovely friend that you've seen in videos before, except for not in this kind of setting. And this is going to be really fun. She has nicely agreed to try Korean snacks. So let me start off by saying, Annyeonghaseyo. She also learned it. Annyeonghaseyo. Look, she's more Korean than me. So we're going to try, this is an American trying Korean snacks and treats. So I just went to the H Mart and picked up a ton of Korean snacks and treats. And so we're going to get a unbiased opinion on what she thinks about these treats. And so some of them, I'm, I'm thinking that majority of them are Korean. Some of them could be otherwise because your girl can't read Korean yet. So I apologize to all my fellow Koreans. I'm still learning. But we are going to just dive right into it. And the first thing we've got is this uh, grilled seaweed. And that's right. what it looks like. Yeah. So we're going to open this up. You know. Sounds entertaining. This really should be called like Korean and American trying Korean snacks for the first time because honestly a lot of these snacks I've never had because I wasn't raised in Korean culture. So although I am Korean, I'm not all that Korean. So take a whiff of that. Let me know what you think. It smells like seaweed. Okay. So we're actually both going to do this because I don't want to like just leave her in the dark. So you grab a seaweed She'll be good with sliver. The coffee. Yes, yeah, so we've been drinking coffee, so I don't know how well this is going to go. Ooh. You think Pretty so? Good. Yeah. Nice and salty. Yeah. It's actually not that bad. Mm -hmm. Oh, it does. Classic flavor. Mm -hmm. So, mm. a 1 out of 10, how would you rate the grilled seaweed? I like it. Let's go with a 7. Okay, a good 7. I would seven. snack on that. So this next one is really fun, and it's like a, a ramen noodle, but what you do with it is you don't cook it, you smash it, so I'm going to let you do the honors. We get to smash it? Yeah, you get to crumble it up oh, and smash right. it. Yeah. <laughs> so smash the that heck out of it. That is a good way after a really stressful day. Isn't it? really happy. Yeah. All right, so now you go ahead and open it. Okay. And this flavor we got here is bulgogi flavor. So it's like a type of meat that we eat, in, or I say we, that Koreans eat. And so you're gonna take, there should be a flavor pack in there. Yep, so you're gonna open that up and then shake it and you're gonna pour it in the bag and you're gonna shake the bag up aggressively. Aggressively? Yeah, to let all of the... So this pack is all about aggression. It is. So if you're angry, if you need to get some aggression out, if you've had a really bad day at work. This is your snack. This is the best snack to have. All right, so now you're gonna shake that up. Shake it aggressively? Yes. Gotta make sure all the flavor gets mixed in there. I'm gonna let things are flying. Woo! It's also a you know a hazard because <laughs> if you're not careful, right. things will just start going everywhere. I all have right. A little teeny piece. Okay. okay. All right. I don't know what bull what. Bull All right. All right. Ching. Pretty good. So what would you rate it? I like the seaweed more. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, maybe you should try like, I think if you get this chunk, okay. we'll see. All right, big old chunk. Big old chunk. And mm. can you pronounce what this is for all of us? Pushu pushu. She's excellent at her Korean, guys. Better I than me. with a full mouth. Yes, better than me. <laughs> all right, so now we're gonna change things up a bit and do a drink. Ooh. Yeah, this is a really fun drink. It looks fancy. Yeah, it's matcha flavor. Matcha. Yeah, and so this is kind of what it looks like. So you get matcha from the... <laughs> you do. So you're going to pull the green thing off the wrapper. Okay. And you're going to hand me the wrapper. Thank you. You're welcome. And then there is, I'm going to show you guys, there's a, a bead inside here. And the idea is that you push the green thing until the bead goes inside. So you might want to actually put it maybe on the chair. Okay. You gotta push as hard as you can. Your business. I know. It's just let the gym lift my arms out. Like there's like that. Oh, there you go. Woo! Oh, that was kind of fun. That see? Was fun. It is fun. Yeah. So we'll see. All right. What her? Um, I don't know what matcha flavor is. You know? We're gonna see. Yeah. I think it's like an acquired taste. That's interesting. Yeah, yeah, that, that is, is an acquired taste. That is an acquired taste. For yeah. sure. Yeah, I don't hate it. Yeah. I mean, like, it's fine. But you're like, I wouldn't buy that with my own money. Mm -hmm. I, mean, I mean, there are other things.
things I would rather, you know, drink. Yeah. yeah, they have other flavors though. Okay. Like a wide variety. I just kind of got you a flavor that wasn't super like American. Well, she must like it because she keeps going back mm -hmm. for another sip. There you go. So, all right, so we're gonna put this to the side. All right, let's do this. We've got two more in the bag, and then we've also got one that is kind of like I want to say a secret, but it's kind of like saving the best for last, I guess. Ooh, surprise. Yeah, it's a good, it's gonna be a surprise. All right, so now we've got these cuttlefish. Snack. Because who doesn't Chips. want to cuddle with their fish? I mean, look, sometimes I get lonely at night and I'm like, man, if I only had a fish to cuddle. Okay. Well, Murray, we're going to let her try this because she just worked her muscles out at the gym Ugh. and see how well she can open the bag, but apparently not very well. Oh, so oh. Up. She got it. No oh, wait, for real, for real now. Okay, she got it. So take a big whiff. What does it smell Ooh, like? Oh, that's strong. I don't know what that smell is, but it's familiar. Yep. Oh yeah, it's got that nice um, seafood mm -hmm. taste to it. So grab one out of the bag. Okay. All right. And funny so enough, it kind of looks like a stingray. Yeah, in the shape of some type of fish or something. All right. Yes, sorry. Dang. What do you like? It's so good. It kind of tastes like rice cake. It does. So like the rice things that they have in the restaurants. No, I feel like. I feel like I would probably eat this as a snack. I would definitely eat that as a snack. That yeah. and the seaweed. Like Alright, so we're saying that and the seaweed, guys. Mm -hmm. So this, the cuttlefish and the seaweed has so far taken the lead. Yep, those are my two favorites. That's my Korean. It's so, alright, we're learning. And so this last one is a taco. Yep, taco, taco, chip. Taco, oh, taco. Take out taco. Take out chip. Take out your chips. <laughs> and it is in what looks like to be an octopus shape. So oh, okay, so we have the stingrays and the, the octopus. octopus. Yeah. So let's see. Maybe I'm gonna be better at opening these. We're almost there. Almost got there. Guys. Woo! Yeah. All right. However, these don't look any different than the last one. Oh. That's right. The shape. Yep. They basically look like. I mean, they kind of have more of an octopi look to them. Yeah. All right. Go for it. All right. All right. I'm gonna get this curl. <laughs> All right, dang. Hmm. Those are good. I think I like the other ones better. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we kind of like the other ones better, but. But those are good. I could totally eat those. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have some more of those. All right. So, out of all those treats and snacks we've tried so far, what are you thinking? Hmm. I mean, I really like the seaweed, but okay. I just really like seaweed for some reason. All right, Something so this is your favorite? And then the, the cuttlefish for a very close second. Okay, so these. Okay. All right, so those are the top two for her. Um, I think the top two for me are probably going to be the bulgogi, like ramen noodles, and these uh, taco, taco chips. Yeah, so listen to her about the taco, probably not me. Hey, don't look at me. I'm as un-Korean as it gets, although I'm Korean. Um, Alright, so now the next part of the video is going to be a fun one, but we also have to prepare it and then come back. So we'll see you guys shortly. Alright, so we're back with part two of the video for today. And we are doing the spicy noodle challenge, although I've done this like three times already. I thought it uh not let her do this or not make her do this alone so it is the two times spicy noodle challenge and we only just used one pack because we're going to split it but y'all even the one pack is about to be insane so we're going to challenge herself first of all who can eat the most out of their bowl and also whoever needs to take a drink first loses as well so and just so you know guys like let me see i'm going to show you guys how, well, I don't know if you're going to be able to see it. Yeah, there you go. So there's like a lot of like, without spilling it. Anyways, there's a lot of spice in there. So you couldn't see that, but there, just trust me when I say there's a lot in there. So whoever has to tap out first loses. So this should be fun. All, All right. right. Cheers. Yes. <laughs> Woo. All right. Warm. I believe it. 
asking us though. I don't believe in me. <laughs> Marty, you know, little massages. It'll <laughs> open your pores up. Yeah. Open shot Where does it burn the most? Uh, back on my throat. Okay. My lips feel a little bit too. You have quite the advantage though with the chopsticks. It's hard to do it with a spoon. Uh, you get more with a spoon. I don't know if that's a good thing though. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. You get more spice all at once. It's rather strong and I'm feeling it on my <laughs> Good. Going well. It is going quite well for us. Oh. Are you sweating yet? Oh, I'm <laughs> like just crying, you know? No big. Good. Alright. Nose running. I may be done. Oh, no. Yep, I'm done. This is a side effect, but my Ooh. ears itch. <laughs> Tap it out. Alright, guys. My lips. Need some chapstick now. Mm. They're very sad right now. My lips are. You keep going, girl. Good job. Oh, I'm gonna put that down. I've literally, legitimately got tears coming out of my eyes. Mm -hmm. My nose is nice and red. So I literally have like two more bites. You got it, girl. You do it. I'm gonna drink my water. Mm. All right. So for the viewers, I don't believe I finished it. in your mouth. Put some chapstick. Don't do the coffee. Ugh, worse? Yeah. Ugh. your whole Korean food experience. What are you what are you saying? Um I give it an eight. It would be a ten except for the fact that I feel like I'm dying. <sighs> and I only made it through like six noodles. Maybe no. five and a half. The fun part about this is like trying to talk. Mm -hmm. To complete a full sentence. I can't talk. <laughs> we may have to edit out this segment because I think it's about 10 minutes of us going. <gasps> okay. okay, I'm gonna come back and do an outro where I can breathe. Yeah. So there's no need to go to the gym for that. No. Just, you know, burn so we'll be back with you momentarily when we're feeling somewhat normal. Yep. All right, so we're back. We had to take a moment to breathe. And I got chapstick. She got chapstick. I'm still having a hard time like communicating things in full sentences. So you'll have to bear with me, but what would you rate the spicy noodle challenge? Yeah, I don't do spicy noodles apparently. <laughs> so yeah. that's like a two for me. Yeah. You know, the sense of flavor, you know. Well tell me what happened about your red pepper flakes. She's telling me a story. Yeah, my red pepper flakes, I totally took the red pepper flakes and I um, dumped the entire thing accidentally into our dinner one night for my husband and I. 
and um, I couldn't eat red pepper for like the next month because it was awful. Yeah. We tried to eat it and it was not fun. So there's her level of spice, how, how she can handle or not handle spice. I like hot sauce. Yeah. But the two times spicy, you know, apparently I have a five times spicy. Yeah, that's not happening. No. I need like a half time spicy. Yeah, we need like a cut, like a one, like a point five times spicy or something. But I was telling her the flavor, I think, is is okay. It's just the heat. It packs like. The flavor was pretty good. It packs like a really strong heat to it. Like so much so that I'm still like breathing in and breathing out. So, but this time, and I can't, I don't know if like that really counts as me finishing because we split the, the pack in half, but I didn't finish my half of the noodles. I feel like that counts. Because yeah. I did six noodles. Yeah, she's literally got like the whole bowl over there. Shelly's gonna get that later for dinner. Mmm. You know, I'm not that Asian. <laughs> so, overall, how did you, you feel? You feel like you're half Asian, so you got half the bowl. I know, that's right. Yeah. So, yeah, that's why I, you know, rebranded my channel to Half My Soul because yeah. it's only half of me. Um, so out of all the Korean treats, how would you give your overall experience? Do you feel more or less Korean? Uh, definitely more Korean. That's good. Yeah. So. But then I felt less Korean than I ate the spice chips. Yeah. Well, you know, she's learned at least on your Yes. Which is, you know, spectacular in and of its own right. Yeah. If it were just, like, go seaweed, I would totally be, like, all in Korean. Oh, but, yeah. Um, she was, y'all, she was all about that seaweed. Which, by all means, I'm not like huge into like grilled seaweed. Um, I think a lot of that has to do with me not being raised in anything Korean. So, I'm, you know, a horrible Korean, but we're working on it, we're learning. But we, me, Kelsey, we're gonna end the video here. Um, and she might try to like lip sync the outro because I don't think she knows my outro. I don't know the outro. It's, it's a pretty long one. Um, but this is how I end every video, so you can kind of, you know, just try to follow me the best you can. Okay. Um, so, like I say to end every video, peace out, Girl Scout, love you, boo, and keep doing what it is that you're doing because you're amazing and it's amazing, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and this is when we get close to the video okay. camera, and say, I love you and goodbye! I love you.